everyone. Today's squat variation is definitely going to challenge you. It's going to test your balance. It's going to be a hard one, but I want you to bear with me, okay? Because the whole point of this is I wanted you to explore different variations and prove to yourself what you can do. So this is an eagle arm squat. So what you're going to do, if you're a yogi, you're familiar with this posture. I want you to start with your feet shoulders width distance apart little bounce in those knees bring those arms up overhead from right here you're gonna bring the right arm underneath the left arm and you're gonna interlace those fingers or hold them at prayer or even just cross them like this now bend down in those knees okay so get a nice little balance you got you you have your arms bound now when you feel steady I want you to balance on that left foot so ground yourself on that left foot when you're ready you're gonna pick up that right foot and you're gonna bring it around that left foot and wrap it around your calf if you can. If you can't, you can start in layers. So maybe start here, 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 and when you can, wrap it all the way around that calf. So from right here, you're gonna take it down and you're gonna rise back up. Taking it down and rise back up. So very, very slow. Taking it down and then rise back up. And here from the side variation, so you can see the whole point is you don't want to be rolling forward. You want to stay up nice and tall. So eagle arm, grab, ground yourself in that left foot. Bring that right foot around that calf. Stay up nice and tall. So see, I'm not falling forward. Up nice and tall. Take it down. Very slow and rise back up. Down, very subtle movement and back up. If you lose your balance, no big deal. Just get out of it, get yourself back into it. Then explore it on the other side. Hands up overhead, interlace, round, root down in that right foot. Bring that left foot up and around that calf if you can. You're gonna take it down and up. Really takes that balance. So come up and down, nice and slow. And if you need to start by holding on to something and not interlacing those arms, maybe holding onto a chair in front of you, just to kind of get this movement, explore this. And don't forget, you don't have to do them all this way. Take a few of your squats today and just give that a try. So get in your 100 today and don't stop until it's done.